Hi everyone. In today's video, we're going to explore how cardio speeds up your metabolism by increasing your thyroid hormone function. The mechanisms that I will be talking about also are proportional to the intensity and the duration of the cardio. So the more cardio and the more intense, the more those mechanisms are going to be upregulated and the greater increase in thyroid hormone function. Even at baseline, you will have higher faster thyroid function, which means a faster metabolism. One of the mechanisms in which intense cardio is going to upregulate thyroid function is by increasing catecholamine release and triggering more adrenaline release. So your adrenals start to pump out more adrenaline, which is a catecholamine, and that triggers more thyroid release. And so your body learns the more cardio you do that, you need to be able to pump out more catecholamines, so it upregulates thyroid function. So now you have a faster metabolism just overall, even on the days when you're not working out. Another major way in which your thyroid function is upregulated is by sweating. So when you work out and you train more intensely and for a longer period of time, you sweat more. The more you sweat, the more you require an increased function of your sodium potassium ATP pump. The sodium potassium ATP, ATPase pump, just think of it as an enzyme or a protein on the cell surface of your cells, which regulates fluid balance. And it basically prevents fluid accumulation or dehydration. And so when you're sweating in order to lower your core temperature when you're working out, you have increased demands on your sodium potassium ATP pumps. And so when you have increased demands on those pumps, what ends up happening is now you trigger more thyroid hormone release because you need more thyroid, specifically T3, which is the active form of thyroid. You now need more T3 being released in order to increase the number of sodium potassium ATPase pumps on the cell surface of your cells. And so the more cardio you do, the more you sweat, the more you keep sending those signals to your body to start increasing thyroid, especially T3 release, so that this increased thyroid release, thyroid hormone release, is going to increase the number of sodium potassium ATPase pump expression on your cell surface or your cellular membrane so that now you have an easier time regulating fluid balance during the intense demands of a cardio session. And the beautiful thing about that is that your thyroid hormone function and your T3 levels are going to be upregulated all the time. You will always have this faster metabolism, not just during that cardio session. All right, that was a little intro with regards to how cardio speeds up the metabolism. I hope you enjoyed this kind of content. If you did, make sure you check out my group coaching and also make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit that little notification bell icon so YouTube alerts you every time I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.